You got a couple of right lanes out with that accident. And Route 4 is some westbound trouble getting over to Spring Valley Road. You are loaded out of Teaneck, 80 westbound. If it works, does it work better or what? New Jersey Turnpike, that is off to a pretty decent start so far. And in Connecticut, the construction work really hasn't started to affect you yet on the Merritt or 95 because none of it's out there yet. And we'll take the early win on Long Island. Eastbound Long Island Expressway, a slow go getting out to Glen Cove Road. Northern State is better. Southern State Parkway, some eastbound brake lights as you get past the Meadowbrook but Sunrise Highway is going to do just fine for you. So if that works, it's going to work a whole lot easier. Subway delays at this hour on the Q trains, and the 2 and 3s are running slower than they should, but everything else is pretty much on or close to schedule. I'm Greg Rice in the WCBS Traffic Center. Early clouds will give way to some clearing as we head into tonight. So lows will range from the 30s in most suburbs to about 40 in the city. Plenty of sunshine for tomorrow with a gusty, chilly breeze, a high of 51. Any breeze will diminish heading into tomorrow night, and it will, temperatures will really start to tumble. It'll be a clear night, low 38 in the city, down into the 20s in some suburbs. So cold start to the day on Wednesday, but we're back up to 52 with a good deal of sunshine for the afternoon. And a beautiful day Thursday, even milder with sunshine and a few clouds, high 61. Increasing clouds on Friday, a mild day with a high of 63. Some showers are likely Friday nights, and the clouds in a morning shower in spots Saturday. It will turn out breezy and cooler with some sunshine and a high of 56. I'm active with the media ballot, just Brian Thompson. It's 46 now at Teterboro, 49 at Newark Liberty, and here in Lower Manhattan, 46 degrees at 720 at WCBS. In Somerset County, they're trying to save some Revolutionary War history. We'll explain that next on Drive Time. Life insurance. Why are you putting it off? Can't afford it? Too much hassle? Well, this is um, WCBS on Medium Wave AM. Um, in general, the medium wave uh, portion of the XH data, both the original D109 and the 109WB are excellent. Um, this I got nothing to complain. I even hear uh, uh, Eterodynes. I've heard a few Eterodynes of a uh, couple of European tonight. Uh, seems propagation is kind of interesting. So 880 WCBS coming in quite well. Uh, and of course, with the internal ferrite, so you got to, you know. Turn the radio in the direction that you want for depending on what station you're going to hear. But it's uh, kind of cool, works pretty well. And uh, nothing to complain on medium wave. Pretty sensitive and uh, decent uh, if you uh, just want to, you know, have fun and just uh, tune around medium wave. Definitely uh, an interesting radio for that. And, uh, you know, even if you buy it. For the NOAA weather radio part and for the uh, AM FM part, you get a great radio here. Uh, you know, the mostly the complaint I get or I will give is a little bit on shortwave, but even even shortwave, pretty surprising. So for the price, you, you got a good package here on the XH Data D109 WB. If having turkey for the holidays, buy from a local farm, get one of those USDA or Glenn, or certified green. We may be Sarah one thing. It becomes a million things for our planet. We'll cure one thing. WCBS News Time 722 on Drive Time. Somerset and